Nigeria Liquefied Natural Gas Limited has signed a multi-billion naira memorandum of understanding with some Nigerian teaching hospitals as part of its hospital support program. The Managing Director and Chief Executive Officer, NLNG, Dr. Philip Michel Bila, at the MOU signing ceremony in the nation's capital, Abuja, said the first phase of the NLNG hospital support program to get 12 hospitals from the six zones. He said beyond the provision of quality medical care for Nigerians, the hospital support program will enhance the training of medical professionals, as well as contribute positively in transforming the nation's medical sector. This HSP approved by the NLNG Board of Directors for the 12 university teaching and tertiary hospitals across the six geopolitical zones and Abuja will be executed at the cost not exceeding 500,000 US dollars per hospital. NLNG will respect every element of the MOU and we expect that all parties to this MOU will do the same. As you are responsible and accountable for the successful execution of the projects within project scope, schedule, and budget. And so we will be monitoring and following up to ensure that indeed all of us play our part to deliver these various projects. Government alone cannot and should not be left to fund public hospitals if we are to achieve quality healthcare delivery in the country. This initiative from the NLNG is therefore very commendable and it is a challenge to other private organizations to support the health sector for a healthy nation is a wealthy nation. On our part as chief executives of these hospitals, we promise to co-supervise, co-monitor, maintain and protect these projects we shall ensure value for money. Dr. Michel Bilo also noted that as part of its corporate social responsibility, the company donated medical equipment and consumables worth over 1.4 billion naira to some federal and state medical institutions to ease the burden of COVID-19 pandemic in its host community. In helping to build a better Nigeria, of course there are many things that we can go after, but education, Healthcare have, are amongst the priority areas that we've elected to focus on. And like I said, this for me really is, is something I can connect to because I can see the direct benefit that it has on our wider population in the country. The ob objective of this national CSR is to boost healthcare delivery system in 12 university teaching hospitals cutting across all six geopolitical zones in the country. Each facility is being catered for based on results of their need analysis, which were carried out in conjunction with the respective hospitals to determine a final intervention area in each teaching hospital. Minister of Health Osage Ehanire, represented by the Rector Public-Private Partnership and Diaspora Unit, Federal Ministry of Health, Dr. Omobolanle Olowu, commended the giant strides of NLNG in repositioning the nation's medical sector. The NLNG Hospital Support Program is the latest addition to the several significant CSR projects the company is implementing. The six teaching hospitals in first phase of the program are Lagos University Teaching Hospital, Lagos, University of Abuja Teaching Hospital, Guagolada, Aminu Kano Teaching Hospital, Kano, Others include University of Benin Teaching Hospital, Benin, University of Calabar Teaching Hospital, Calabar, and Niger Delta University Teaching Hospital, Yenogua. The first phase of the program is scheduled to be completed this year, while the second phase in 2023. See and News.